Hello everyone, I'm Grant Likely and I'm here in Bangkok at Lanaro Connect with Keital Gandhi, Senior Product Manager at Qualcomm. Welcome to Bangkok, Keital. Thank you. Uh, now, Keital, I understand that you've got quite an interesting contest going on right now. That's right. Uh, there is a Qualcomm uh, Maker contest running on Qualcomm Developer Network. The URL is dragonboardcontest.com. And we are basically giving away one dragon board a day to uh, uh, winners of the uh, contest uh, that enter an idea of what they want to do or what they want to make with dragon board. And uh, the, the cool part of the contest is that ideas are selected by fellow makers. Mm -hmm. And um, there is also a grand prize that all the contestants become eligible to win, which is a $5,000 uh, grand prize at the end of the month. So this is the Maker Month contest and I welcome uh, makers and developers to enter their ideas on, on the contest. That sounds like a great contest. What sort of projects have you been seeing coming out of events like these? So as you know, Dragon Board uh, 410C, which is based on the 96 board spec, is a very versatile platform, uh, very powerful with many, many features on there. So there are many different options for developers and makers uh, to come up with different applications. Mm -hmm. We have seen a lot of different projects come out uh, using Dragon Board, all the way from a 360 degree camera to a virtual reality projects, uh, from uh, industrial IoT to uh, smart home applications and um, uh, even high performance computing uh, applications being run on Dragon Board. So there are um, quite a few um, challenges uh, that needs to be solved in this IoT space. And we expect a, a lot of uh, ideas in, in, in uh, many different applications. What resources do the developers who are participating in this contest have access to? That's a very good question. Uh, we have a lot of resources uh, available on developer.qualcom.com as well as 96boards.org, a lot of documentation and video. Uh, and in addition to that, uh, there are many IoT uh, SDKs or uh, cloud uh, platforms uh, available that's working out of the box on Dragon Board, including Amazon AWS uh, IoT SDK, AT&T M2X APIs, IBM Bluemix APIs. Uh, for, uh, for people interested or for makers interested in robotics application, uh, robot operating system also is ported on Dragon Board 410C. So those are uh, some of the software resources. Um, the operating systems that are supported on Dragon Board are uh, Android, Linux, and Windows. So there is many different options for application developers to pick uh, the, their favorite platform from. Uh, and then there is uh, the whole 96 board mezzanine uh, ecosystem behind this board. So there are quite a few mezzanine boards that are already out in the market. You, uh, they are listed on the 96boards.org mezzanine uh, webpage. Uh, Link Sprite kit from Aero, there is a sensors mezzanine uh, adapter board uh, with a Grove starter kit available from Seed. And also uh, there is uh, an ST micro uh, sensors board that is uh, going to be available soon. Uh, these are all the mezzanine boards. Uh, and then there are additional uh, mezzanine boards and accessories coming up. So there are uh, very many tools and resources available for developers to pick from when they start developing their ideas. Uh, for now, the contest is about entering the ideas into the system. Well, thank you. Thank you for spending some time with me today, and I hope you enjoy the rest of your time in Bangkok. Thank you.